The following segment is brought to you by Inspire Joy Publishing. Did you struggle with mental health as a child or maybe you didn't even realize it? Well, Melanie is here to tell us about her best-selling book and goal to raise awareness about mental health in children, which is so important. Thank you so much for being here, Melanie. Thank you so much for having me. It's been so fun chatting with you, you know, before the segment because she has 16 children's books that she has written. She's such a rock star. Let's talk about your book about anxiety, which is your bestseller and why you decided to write it. This is my very best seller, and I think it's because it's such a timely, important topic. Um, when my, one of my older children were very small, about 20 years ago, she struggled with anxiety, and I didn't know what it was. I didn't know what was causing it. Mm -hmm. All I knew was that she was having temper tantrums, and I couldn't understand why, I, and I couldn't fix it. And I wish I had a resource like this when she was little to help her to um, understand it herself and to know what it was. And I think it's just such an important topic um, for kids. Absolutely, it's this one right here, and I know you have it in English and Spanish. What research went into this book? So, um, just when being I, a mom, probably. <laughs> being a mom, knowing that my child was dealing with this and struggling with this, and um, over the last 20 years, I've learned a lot. I have anxiety, she has anxiety. Um, I think to some degree we all do, and it's what pushes mm -hmm. us to be better. It's what pushes us to study for a test that we're nervous about. Um, you know, or, or practice a little harder so we can make the team. Um, and so having anxiety is not a bad thing, and I think that's something that's really important for kids to understand. Um, it, w my very favorite page in the book talks about the why behind it. Um, and it says, my monster likes to visit me because I have a big, kind, caring heart that fills emotions very deeply, and that's a really good thing. I think it's so important for kids to understand that it's not a bad thing. It doesn't mean that they're broken. Doesn't mean they're broken. No, and it's it's different in kids. If we you know we know what we have it as adults, right. symptoms would be different in children. So it's good to be able to help them and be able to give them the resources that they need. And right. you wrote this book over two years ago, Melanie. I Why did. do you think that it's still your number one bestseller? Um, just looking at the recent um, news. I mean, just in the last week, there's so much that we struggle with as adults to understand. Um, and our kids do as well. I wrote this right at the very beginning of the COVID lockdown when schools were shutting down and everything was just kind of in chaos. And I know I, as an adult, was really struggling with that. It was a scary time for me. It was a scary time for my kids. And I wanted to make sure that they had something that they could help, you know, that could give them some practical tips and solutions to help with this. Um, I sent this to three different child psychologists and therapists to make sure everything was medically correct information um, to make sure I was putting out the best product available for them so that they it could be something that could not only help children but also start that important conversation of mental health with families I think that's so important you know just making sure that it's not a taboo topic absolutely it is so important and I'm I'm so glad you have written this in such a beautiful children's book you have so many that we can choose from Melanie if we want to purchase one of your books right now where can we follow you um, you can follow me on Instagram at inspire joy publishing or um, all of my books are on my website melaniehawkinsauthor.com okay amazing thank you for all you're doing congrats on your success Melanie thanks for being here thank you